OK. On number four. Uh, whoa. So number four says, determine whether or not the triangles are similar. If so, write a similarity statement. If not, what would be sufficient to prove the triangles are similar? Explain your reasoning. So what we have here is a right triangle that has 60 degrees. So K, S, M. And then over here, we have a triangle that has 30 degrees and a right triangle and a right angle. So Q, R, T. Now, if you guys remember last class period, there's three different ways that we could prove similarity between two triangles. Devin, do you remember one? Do you remember one way we could prove similarity? It was in our notes last class period. Just one. Maybe Mark can help you out. Mark, would you remember the first one? Uh, angle, angle. That's right. If we can find two angles that are exactly the same between two triangles, then we can show that they are similar to each other, right? Carly, do you remember another one? Do you remember another similarity? Is the only way to prove triangles are similar if you can have all the, if you can have two angles? No? Taylor, do you remember one? Yeah, if you have two sides that are proportional to each other and the included angle is equal, then you can show that they're similar. And there was one more. Kind of what we've already talked about up in class. Yeah, if you can show that all the sides are proportional to each other, then they are similar. All right? So in this case, do we know anything about the side lengths? Do we know anything about the side lengths? No. 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 So we're probably not going to be able to use proportionality of side, 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 or proportionality of side, angle, side. So I need to determine, well, do we have two angles that are, that are the same? So um, Terrell, when he looks up here, he can see that, all right, I know these both have 90 degrees, but that's 30 and that's 60. So they're both not the same. However, I do have two angles in a triangle. And when I have two angles in a triangle, I know I can find the third side or the third angle. Well, to do that, I have 180 minus 90 minus 60. And that will equal um, angle M, right? And then if I did over here, I'd say 180 degrees minus 90 minus 30 degrees equals the measure of angle T. Would you guys agree with that? Because all the angles in a triangle add up to 180. So if I take the two angles I know, subtract them from 180, that's going to give me my missing angle. And when you guys do this work, what you notice is 30 degrees equals the measure of angle M. And 60 degrees equals the measure of angle T. So therefore, that's 30 and that's 60. Now, ladies and gentlemen, can we show that the two angles have two two congruent angles, or the two triangles have two congruent angles? Can we show that? Can we say that? Yeah. yeah. So guess what? These triangles are similar. So you'd write triangle SMK is similar to triangle uh, RQT. All right? That's it. All right, so let's get into some.